sure there are times when you really want your children to go to sleep, but any movement you make or any noise you make wakes them up. Here's the opposite end of that spectrum. We have here a toddler asleep in her bed. So asleep, I can make a movie. I can flick her ear. I can touch her nose. I can check her diaper. And she's still asleep. And if we look at a second toddler over here, who's sleeping through my making of the movie with the first toddler, her too, I can flick her ears, and she's still asleep. I can touch her hand, and she's still asleep. And yet you know that if you wanted her to be asleep, well, any slight rustle of a grasshopper's wings would wake her up. Oh, wow. Well. All right. Taxi dog, what do you think we're going to do? What do you think we have to do to wake up these girls? I know. We'll have to think about it. Got any ideas? Let us know. Or just go to sleep yourself.